Hey everyone, I don't know why this is all blurry, but uh, just a quick update on Rebel. Uh, back at Jim and Cindy's Plow Day last year, um, I don't know if you recall, but there was a little bit of magic smoke that got let out of this one. Well, tonight I was taking the hitch off so I could uh, mount up a snow plow on another tractor. And I see this twig. I'm yanking on it. And then I'm like, that's attached. That, that's the wiring for the rear light. And that is probably what happened. I'm guessing that the light switch got bumped. And in the midst of everything, we didn't see whether the lights were on or not. But that looks like it shorted out. Well, this is a non-wheel horse plow. I don't know how to really identify it. It's manual adjustment. And somebody made it to fit a wheel horse. And we're going to try it out on Poppy. And my guess is that by the end, I'm going to have a Popeye arm. So uh, we'll see how this goes. Well, first impressions with Poppy, the 7 horsepower, 552, with the 27-inch intercos, and the big R4s up front with a 48-inch blade is my front tires are a little too wide um the the tires when i'm turning the inside of the tire hits the plow frame and so i'll probably stick some skinnies up front there and otherwise i think i could still benefit from maybe some tire chains because i was slipping on some ice but otherwise man this thing pushes pushes really well could probably use a new belt it was slipping as well and that clutch pedal is way far back so a new belt would help with that too but otherwise i guess i've got another plow tractor